tonight I have heard that obviously Bad Brad Michaels is in the house for the first time since he won the IDW Championship, ladies and gentlemen. Are you guys ready to see what, see him and hear what he has to say? Because we all know he's going to run his mouth, right? That's what he does. And of course, he is a part of Impact Inc. now. I also heard tonight in the house we have Paige Turner. And of course, Erica's here tonight. Diva! 
out here because the hype section that packed the Impact Arena tonight. Now last week, I tried to come out here and address the hype section because I wanted to get something off my chest about when I was, dare I say, screwed out of the IZW Championship. You know, that moment was a real kick in the face, literally and the other way, because it opened my eyes on how things change so rapidly here in IZW. You never know what's going to happen. You never know when you show up if someone's just going to come take a title shot they don't deserve, come out here and steal your championship. You never know. So Brad, I think you need to be taught that lesson because you never know when the fight's going to be brought to you. You never know when you're going to be in a championship matchup. Last week, I defeated Kevin Morgan and your boy Mark Wilson said I get to keep my title shot. Well, I don't want to wait. Hype section, do you want to wait for that title matchup? I'm looking at the hype section and it's kind of thick out here tonight. There's a whole lot of members of the hype section that I think y'all should be rewarded. So Brad Michaels, I think you should give the hype section what they want. I think you should give me what I want. I think you should bring your pasty ass out here and you should face me for the ICW Championship, not later, but right here tonight. I know it's gonna be weird, Brad, to face me one-on-one -on -one because you're not used to that. You like it when your opponent's backs are turned. But tonight, Brad, I'm ready. Are you ready, hype section? No cheap shots tonight. Get down here and face me for the ICW Championship. I didn't expect him to come out here and just...
me to come out here and respond to you. You know, I may not be on the greatest terms with a certain philosopher, as you like to say, but I know a man that said, you don't like it, we don't care. So whether you like it or not, I am coming out here to respond to you. You said, as the IZW champion. You remember what that was like? You champion the respect that he deserves. I don't I don't think they respect you. At least it didn't sound like they respected you. Hold on, man, I'm talking. Do you guys respect the IZW champion Bad Brad Michaels? Do you guys respect Jermaine Johnson? Hey, hey, hey. I think you're already kind of behind the eight ball on this one, but I'll let you get back to it. You know what? I have never cared about adversity or odds. I've been working in and around this business since I was 13 years old. And now I stand in front of you, the standard bearer, the IZW champion. And I don't care if these people respect me or not. I don't. These people don't define me. This, the IZW championship, defines Bad Brad Michaels. I get it, Brad. You've been you've been do, working at this since you were 13, right? I seen you talking about how for 16 years you've wanted to be IZW champion. But let's be real, Brad. Has it really been 16 years? You pop in here once or twice a month every blue moon and claim to want to earn to be the top man in this company. I'm giving you an opportunity to be the top man because stealing this from someone who's already down doesn't make you a champion, Brad. Facing me one-on-one -on -one and beating me will make you a real champion, but you can ask the hype section, they don't think you Again, maybe look, no, no, one second. Because I, I think, I think, I don't know, I have to agree with him on this. I know y'all don't want me in this, but I mean, I'm kind of important around here. And I just, I know, I just, I think that maybe you're right. You're right on this one. I mean, you say that what he did doesn't make him the IZW champion, but I mean, he's standing here with the IZW championship belt, so I think what he did when he kicked your teeth out of your mouth was made himself the IZW champion. I'm saying, remember that. He came down when you were all beat up and then he kicked your teeth out of your mouth. Yeah. That's right. You see, it doesn't matter whether you saw it coming or not. It was one on one and professional wrestling is about being the smarter man. And if that means I have to kick a man in his face while he's down, then so be it. And you say, I might never know when a championship match is going to happen. I beg to differ. I'm the IZW champion, and I call the shots for this belt. So with that being said, Commissioner Wilson, I've got a great idea. I think you're going to love it. Jermaine Johnson thinks he's entitled to a rematch for the IZW Championship. Jermaine Johnson thinks he wants Bad Brad Michaels in this ring. And I'm willing to let that happen under these circumstances. <laughs> I'll tell you what I've got. I've got, how about Jermaine Johnson runs the gauntlet?
before you have an opportunity, before you have the right to look across the ring and see me in this championship, you've got to do a couple of things first. You're going to have to beat Damon Windsor. You're going to have to beat Johnny Z. And if, and that's a slim chance, if you can go through the two of them, then and only then will you get another shot at this championship. Uh, I want to see uh, if he's chicken, um, if he's going to accept or not. I mean, you want to know if Jermaine I Johnson is chicken. I want to know if hey, Jermaine Johnson's a Hey, IZW Arena, is Jermaine Johnson chicken? Yes! John, how many times do I have to establish I don't care what they think? Hey, hype section, is Jermaine Johnson a chicken? Why are we asking okay. them? Well, because, because, I mean, I'm not on this guy's side in any way. Are you sure about that? I am 100% sure. A couple months ago, I took like eight German suplexes in a row from this dude, okay? So I'm not on his side. It was when I was the IZW champion. The good old days. Yeah, yeah, the good old days. Well, I mean, unlike the IZW championship, though, there are some things that don't change, Brad. Like you not being the man and me being the man. See, things, things like that don't change. I mean, hey, it's cool. You're the IZW champ, man. If Good you for wanna, you. If you want a shot, Good for just, you. Just talk. But, but you're not the man. You see, you don't make calls for Johnny Z. You don't make calls for Damon Windsor. And I mean, your gauntlet idea, it's a great idea. It really is. I mean, it's an idea I would have came up with like a decade ago. You know, in the good old days. Yeah, yeah. Decade ago. Decade ago. For me, right? Yeah, oh, I, I don't know about that. I was winning championships while you were hanging out at the house. But, um, long story short, and you know about short. Long, no, oh, oh Brad. Brad. I didn't mean to step on your toes. Oh. Damon and I aren't available for a gauntlet match tonight. Long story short. We can do it next week. Uh, we're not available for a gauntlet match next week. Maybe you missed it, but Damon and I are the IZW Tag Team Champions. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, and, 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 I understand you're jealous because I actually earned this uh, championship. Uh, I didn't just walk out here with one. Jealous of what, your receding hairline? Oh, the one that looks I, just like yours? No, I, hey, hey, this is the thing. We're going to find opponents for our tag team championship. Better step back. Man, I know my hype section is loving this drama that's going on. This trouble in paradise between the fake tag champs and the fake IZW champ. Hey, I know we're there's loving. About this we're loving this. There's nothing to think about, about this champ. Hey, hey, hey. Boys, boys, we are impacting. We are not five individuals. We are not six individuals. We are one group. We are control. All right? We are the tag team champions. You need the you are the kiss and make up. Shut up. Oh, man, my bad. Hey, my bad. My coming. bad, yeah. Brad, what if I want to talk? Brad, John, just a second. This is all going to be good because we don't need a gauntlet match because my man Mark is going to fix all this, aren't you, Mark? You better fix it, Mark. You better fix it now. Yeah, yeah Mark, now. Yeah, yeah, Mark, you better fix it. Please. Yeah, you better get these two's diapers changed real quick. Error, it's error, because error. you're babies. Oh, 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 oh. I'll fix it. Hey, Brad, calm down. John, come on. I'll fix it. I always, I'm the fixinator. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Jermaine Johnson, last week, you had to put your number one contendership up. Well, you're going to do the exact same thing tonight. And 
now I've already put you in a match against Kevin Morgan, so you are going to face Double D, and you are going to face him right now. And if you lose, you will not face Bad Brad Michaels for the IZW Championship. Do you hear that? Do you hear that? So, so, if Jermaine Johnson wins, he still faces Brad Michaels for the IZW Championship at Evolution. And if, and if Double D wins, he faces Brad Michaels for the IZW Championship at Evolution. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, you fixed it great. Things are looking up for the champ. Hit our music! This is great.
get up here, Erica. Get her up. Erica, sit right there. I want you to watch this.
Are you tired of the same old birthday party? Well, now's your chance to party with your favorite IZW superstar. See yourself on the big screen while you experience your own personalized entrance. Customized cake and bounce house available. Hop into the ring and go crazy. And then take the memories home on DVD and Blu-ray. Call 580-699-7IZW and party like an IZW superstar. Just come to Impact Inc. to customize your skin. Now you can customize your t-shirt with competitive prices and high quality graphic designs. We're your one-stop shop for wearing your ink. Whether it's for your school, office, athletic team, or just your personal attire, we can take anything you imagine and turn it into a shirt that makes an impact. And if you have an idea but need help with your design, we can do that too. Call 699-7530 or stop by 1008 Southwest 11th Street and just ask to talk to Candace. From skin sleeves to shirt sleeves, wear your art, love your ink. Impact Inc. champion of all time. See, Bobby, I've, I've moved on. I've moved on. I've no. outgrown you. Oh, Bobby, 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 no, 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 no. Look at my eyes, look at my eyes. I know this hurts you. I know this no. hurts you. But I don't no. mean for it to hurt you. But I don't care that it hurts oh. you. It just has to happen this way. Come on, Bronzeville. Bobby, we can look. work this out. So We've been what? through this. We can do this. The gods have spoken, Bronzeville. We can do this. Raspel, Raspel. Come on. We could work this out. But I don't want to. I want to be awesome. Champion best ever. That's what I want to be. You, you know what you need? You need to talk to the gods. You need to talk to the gods. Raspel. Just go to Mount Olympus Come and on, talk Raspel. to the gods. They'll tell you what to do. We can, we can go to Mount Olympus Raspel. together. Just like old times. Come on, bro. There it is. Bronze Bull. Bronze Bull! Bronze Bull, come on, man! Yes, give daddy some sugar. 
Mark Wilson. Mark Wilson, Mr. Commissioner. Um, I, I've got a question. I've got a request for you uh, in your position as commissioner. I, I obviously you're a man in charge. You, you're you're the go-to kind of guy, and and we've got big events coming up. One of my one of my responsibilities as the re the voice of ICW is to try to keep the fans updated with all kinds of information that's coming to them when it comes to these upcoming events here at the Impact Arena. We've got. Evolution coming up July 18th, our next big pay-per-view event, huge, on live on GFL.TV. I was hoping that perhaps you might have some exclusive information that you could share, that I could take to the ICW world when it comes to matches or announcements or, or anything pertaining to that event. Um, Grizzly Adams, you come rolling up on Bill Gates. Get up in his face, ask him what's going on. You walk up to Hillary Clinton, like a little chihuahua. Huh? Well, I mean, you're you're the man in charge. I am the man in charge, and you're not showing me the proper respect that you should show me. Asking me a bunch of questions, but I'll tell you what, I've got a scoop. You do. I've got a scoop. You do. Well, 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 great. I mean, are, are you gonna are you gonna put it out there on on Twitter or or Facebook or or, or hey, how about an exclusive for Oaklandfan.com? I mean, that that'd be great to, to let the fans know about about this. Big, where we, where big we, where hyphenated we, words, big words. Nobody understands. But you're just, you know, a little bird. Well, okay, well, what what are you gonna do? What I'm going to do is, if you want to know why CM Barton doesn't run a comb through his hair every week. If you want to know the dirty little secret about Johnny Z and me, and we went to that Notre Dame game, and there was things that happened on that trip, and, you know. If you want to know about the love child, Double D and Erica's love child, the little sordid details, call 1-900-STALLION-1. Call today. Kids, go get in your parents. Get the money clip out. Get them their purse. I want you to get in there, spend that money. Don't tell mom and dad. Five fifty for the first minute. Two ninety nine each additional minute. A, a hotline. One nine hundred stallion one. Stallion one. Oh, one like like the number one Sean McHale. No, no, it's yeah. not like the number oh, one I, Sean McHale. What? That has nothing to do with Sean. One nine hundred stallion one. That's my number. Call the number, kids. Get on the phone. Dial today. Dial, dial, dial. Don't ever bring up McHale to me again.
Thank you.
Mr. Wilson, um, hi, uh, CM Burnham. Uh, I I know we got off to a bad start before when I when I came up to you, and I know that that, that you're a busy man. Um, busy, yeah, very busy. Yeah, I, I tried to contact your executive assistant, and and I, I got no response there. So I told her to. Know. But but here's the deal. See, um, I really think that it would be it would be a real big help. When it comes to, to evolution, July 18th, live on GFL.tv, I think it would be a really big help in, in promoting that event, in, in bringing extra awareness and interest to that event. If you, as commissioner, if you could give me an exclusive bit of information, something that just hasn't been set out there yet to the people, if you could give me that to share with the ICW world, this event would be would be even bigger than it already is going to be. Can we make that happen? You want to know why I believe that Bad Brad Michaels is the greatest IZW champion of all time? You want to know why Brad Michaels holding the IZW championship is the evolution of Impact Inc. taking us higher? Do you know anything about evolution? No, you wouldn't. You're two steps below Amoeba. Do you want to know why Impact Inc. continues to evolve and step forward? Johnny Z, the facilitator Damon Windsor, are going to bring the IZW Tag Team Championships back to Impact Inc. You want to know how that's going to happen? That would be great. No, any of that stuff, absolutely. Can you give me any line? I can. Yeah, you can? Please. Call 1-900-STALLION-1. Call 1-900-STALLION-1 today, Daddy. Not 1-900-STALLION. That's the wrong number that you get. You don't want to. Kids, get your parents' money out of their pocket. Go to their billfolds. Go to their purses. Steal that money. $5.99 the first minute. $2.99 each additional minute. Man, get on the hotline, Burnham. Spend some of that hard-earned money you made. Well, you don't have any money. You don't look like you... The, the hotline. Address again, you. again with the hotline. The hotline, Daddy! 1-900! Stallion one. one. Ha ha! Call it! Today! The hotline.
For the past few weeks, I've had this thorn in my side. He's came out. He's cost me a number one contendership. He's went after one of my friends. Total darkness. I just have one thing to say to you. There's only one man that truly comes through the dark. But I've got another thing that I want just a little bit more, and that's the IZW Championship. Three weeks ago, I faced Brad, Brad Michaels right here. I beat Bad Brad Michaels right here. Now, he has that championship. I believe now I am entitled to have a match for that championship. And I want it right now. Come on, Brad. You want it? Some of my 
my own things, but you can't seem to keep my name out your mouth. One nine hundred stallion one. You know who the number one is, and that's this man right here, the number one. You seem to be throwing number one around as far as number one contenderships. You want to go out the last few weeks, make Jermaine Johnson put up his number one contendership, contendership up every week because you want to keep the number one in your mouth. All that talking, Mark. All that talking. All that talking made me do one thing, and that's get my big butt back in here and tell you how it really is, if you will. Oh, I will. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Because all that you've done, you've just solidified that Jermaine Johnson is the number one contender. And at Evolution, July 18th, he will be there. However, his opponent now is up in the air because as far as I can tell, I always do one more better than you because I'm the one, number one, and you're the number two. I'm the number one, and you're straight doo-doo. It's good for me and it's good for you. I'm the number one, and you're the number two. Because tonight, that man right there, the image of fear, Kevin Morgan, is going to get exactly what he wants because in the main event tonight, he's getting Bad Brad Michaels. Which brings me back to what I just said. We have no idea who Jermaine's, uh, Jermaine's opponent is going to be at Evolution July 18th because that championship the IZW Championship is also on the line. So let's just put out the headline. Kevin Morgan, the image of fear, taking on Bad Brad Michaels in the main event for the IZW Championship tonight. And if you want to know why, Mark Wilson, let me give you the finger, because I'm the number one. Now hit my music. Thank you. 
You know, it seems that we've got the ring all to ourselves, Mark Wilson. Lisa Gennaro, it looks like the focus is on the real reason. They're all here for the show. I know that each and every one of you came out here tonight to witness the greatness that is the natural born leader, Johnny Z. And now that you've got to witness the role model that all you little youngsters should look up to, the man that all you women want to go home with, I think that I should address the former tag team champions, the KC Wolves. Now, you know, we lost a great wrestling legend this past week. But you know, he's not the only wrestler that the wrestling world lost because the way I see it, after the way we threw the KC Wolves out into the woods, and told them to go find their weak ass pack. I would say the KC Wolves are just as much dead to this business as Dusty Rhodes. The only thing your focus needs to be on is right here in the middle of the ring, the best thing you got going in the living flesh. The natural born leader, Johnny Z, the facilitator, Damon Windsor, your IZW Tag Team Champions, and what will go down as the greatest IZW Tag Team Champions of all time. Hit that music.
Ramsey. Cut the music. Hold on, dude in the red shirt. Hey, hey. By the curtain. Hey, you, hold on, daddy. I know we got that ass beat tonight. But uh, there's still some unfinished business. We'll see you. We'll see you, Brad. But tonight, uh, tonight's not all about you. On behalf of Impact Zone Wrestling, we dedicated this show tonight in the memory of the American dream, Dusty Rose. As a lot of you know, Dusty Rose competed in this ring as a member of the ICW roster. He, he tagged with that no good piece of crap, Brad Michaels. He, he, took, he took on Johnny Z and, and Aaron Neal and, and Bernie D and he touched I think I can speak for all of us. He touched each and every one of us emotionally and we'll never forget him. So right now, on behalf of the entire IZW roster that's here tonight, we're gonna stand here, we're gonna pay tribute to the American dream with the 10 bell salute. Come on up here, Anna Lynn. Don't you got some business to take care of? What you doing? Huh? Ah, right, man, come on down. Come on down, Sean. Come on down, Maddox. You got that ass beat, too. Didn't you get that ass beat? Sean didn't get that ass beat. You didn't get that ass beat. We want to see all y'all out here next week where once again we'll wine and dine with kings and queens and we'll sleep in alley and dine on pork and beans. Yeah! Huh? 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 Don't forget Military Appreciation Day next week. What? Go, Annalyn. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know what time.